Hello, my name is Paula Safie. I'm a neurologist and genetic researcher from Chile. My journey began in clinic with patients who showed clear signs of a genetic condition, but had no access to answers. I had no way to help them. I felt responsible to change that, to answer the questions that my patients asked me almost every day. Why do I have this? Could it be genetic? So their questions became my purpose. My PhD project had three steps. First, we reviewed all the genetic studies done on Parkinson's disease genetics across South America. And we showed that almost all research came from Brazil, while countries like Chile had low representation. Despite there was limited evidence, we showed that different genes had different frequencies across countries. Second, we did genetic testing in almost 300 patients with Parkinson's disease from Chile and from Brazil, and we discovered that our regions do not share one genetic story. In Chile, we found a higher frequency of a gene called LAR2, while in Brazil, there were other genes were more common. And this difference is important as each gene has a different progression pattern, treatment response, and could be part of a clinical trial. Finally, we work with researchers around the world to test genetic risk prediction tools with data mainly from people of European ancestry. And as we suspected, they did not perform well in Latin American populations. So we demonstrated with scientific evidence that in genetics, one size does not fit all, and that inclusion matters in genetic research. During this journey, my patients remain my driving force. That is why, alongside my PhD in genetics, I co-led an initiative in the Global Parkinson's Genetic Program to responsibly return research genetic results and to train healthcare professionals in how to do so since most clinicians don't have training opportunities in this field. Change does not begin with research articles. They are necessary, but they are not enough. Change begins when we build bridges across countries, across researchers and clinicians, and more importantly, across patients. It begins when we lift others as we rise. If you had a similar journey, you're welcome to share your experiences in the comments as your voice may help others or encourage someone else. Thank you for your attention.